There are a lot of great stories to be heard at PDAC 2020. Here we are in day two talking about Lorian Mining with Cynthia Lesser Aquin, old friends. How are you? I'm very well, Peter. Thank you for having me here to talk to you today. Well, it's, it's always good hearing what you're up to. You've been so successful in your career, and now you're with Lorian Mining. Absolutely. Now, I've been with Lorian Mineral Exploration since 2003. Um, this is the first cycle that we are really totally in sync with. Um, we've missed every previous uh, cycle. Um, we missed the 2011 cycle. I was right. able to jettison some of the projects, garnered 6.35 million from those uh, projects, invested it into the Ishkade, which is now our flagship property. Well, that's, uh, that's a way to make money is M&A. Out on the shop floor, there's a lot of M&A going on right now rather than drilling activity. But you absolutely. are planning an active drill campaign. That's correct. So we're planning the first of a 100,000 meter drill program. We're about to commence that in that's a lot of money. Summer. Yes, it is a lot of money, um, but I'm fairly confident that we are able to steadily increase our access to capital. We've been very successful over the last two years. Um, I, I now have a very uh, different board. I have, uh, I think, a very good network, a network like water, I'd like to say. Uh, so we have good access to capital, and I'm confident that we'll be able to uh, complete our drill program. Right. Uh, we also have uh, planned some very strategic partnerships um, which will minimize the risk with the company and these strategic partnerships will help uh, deliver us through our, the balance of our exploration. And if I remember correctly, you're looking for gold? Gold in base metals. And you're near Thunder Bay? Northeast of Thunder Bay in, in the, between Beardmore and Geraldton. World famous section, world famous mining area, west of Timmins, significantly west of Timmins. But you have access to infrastructure, power, mining knowledge, labor. You're, you're not far from Lakehead University. Absolutely. And I think there's one, there's one more thing that I should add. We're in a very geopolitically friendly uh, region, which I believe Ontario to be. Yes. Um, the other most important thing is our, our access to the property is, is very easy access just off of uh, Highway 11. And uh, the, the great thing about that is that we've got outstanding exposure to our crop. Um, and, and surface mineralization. So, uh, you know, this makes minimized risk in the exploration. It makes our access and drill costs, exploration costs, pretty much cheaper. And you have good relationships with all local communities, I imagine? I believe that I have very good relationships with my local communities, my good. Aboriginal communities. It's, it's our obligation as mining companies to engage communities better than we have in the past to help close the disconnect that can exist sometimes. And, and, and I totally agree with that. And I think. Uh, it's part of our, our long-term ESG plan, and that long-term ESG uh, creates benefits opportunities for the people in our region, yes. Excellent. Always lovely to see you. I hope to see you in about two hours at that reception, and we can celebrate your success. Amen to that, Peter. Thank you.